Stepanski here, and as you saw from the last video, I really bared it all. The goal of doing that was to really show you what neglect looks like. I'm not gonna try to lie to myself anymore. I have been neglecting my condition and my leg. So my knee is my target joint. If you're watching this, you're a hemophiliac, so I'm not even gonna waste time with terminology and explaining it. I'm just gonna use verbiage that you're familiar with. So I never did prophylaxis care, just did it wasn't a thing and I my clotting factor is less than one percent and it's been that since I was a teenager like I remember being 13 and I, I had this little card and my doctor took it and was like Bloop. and I guess there was a transitional period where I went from a clotting factor of I can't remember to being less than one and and even still that wasn't motivation enough to do something um, and yeah I'm 32 guys like, the, there hasn't been anything that's motivated me to take care of my body. I don't remember the last time I was actually physically able to run. And, and the sad part of this is, is I've always had the tools. I've always had the capability to run, to move, and to be active, and to do all the things that I want to do. But since I wasn't proactive, I'm, I'm left with that. Like, as you saw, in la and I'll cut to a clip of it. <laughs> like that that's where i'm at i have an 18 month old child that i cannot chase after i can limp after but i can't chase them i keep telling myself i'm gonna do something but so now this is the time this is the vlog this is me putting myself out there to the whole community to the whole world to hold me accountable to have that expectation of me. Even if it's only one person out there, a complete stranger, I think that might be motivation. If not, then it's not, and I'll move on to something else to try. So yeah, that's what this channel's about. That's what I'm gonna be tracking. Just my life and what I do day to day. So enjoy. So that was my bike ride from today. I only did one mile. I only plan on doing one mile at a time. I think right now, maybe every other day, ride for one mile to try to get my thigh up to, up to par. I've tried to do more miles before in the past and I just ended up hitting that, hitting that wall to where I end up getting swollen and then depressed and then just hopeless. Uh, after this bike ride, I don't feel any pain. In the past, I would feel pain in my wrist and in my elbows simply because I think the, the setup of the bike was wrong. My front handlebars were too low, so I've adjusted that, and now this bike ride feels a lot better. So this whole mile I rode, I felt really good. My butt felt good. In the past, I actually got a big bruise on my butt. Apparently, that's a thing if you ride bikes. So if you're a hemophiliac that plans on riding bikes and you don't do it yet, get padded underwear. You're going to need it. You're going to have a purple butt if you don't. So definitely get the padded underwear. That's what I did today.